was so convinced I was going to have a ticket then. Hello one and all, welcome to Seen Through Glass. I am running very late in my day. I have been editing the a bath track day footage all morning and it was a long, long edit. I am supposed to be heading off to find Tony from Gravelwood because today he is collecting a brand new Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrofoligio, Foglio, Foglio, QV. I never know how to pronounce that. Uh, anyway, so yes, he's taking it into stock, part of his uh, dealership, uh, and I said I want to see that. So I am about an hour and a half late, but we're going to go and find him. Tony's car and this thing looks absolutely mega but the question is where is Tony? I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, sorry. What perfect weather to collect a 500 horsepower rear wheel drive car. What a monster. Very <laughs> <laughs> good. It looks awesome though. Oh, it looks so good. Just that carbon wing. Oh, oh mate. Oh, mate, it looks wicked. Oh, tricky bugger. <laughs> right, should we take it somewhere to do some proper, proper shots? I was going to film this R8 quickly. I'll get you, uh, I'll get you started. Put sports really exhaust on, yeah? Works. Put it's sports exhaust. Race, right? Go and race, yeah. It's got to go and race. Go and race. Now? Yeah. <laughs> he buggered that up. He buggered that you, you buggered that, that was pathetic. No, you you know buggered what? that right up. This is one of the best sounding cars in the world and you royally you know buggered what? it up. It won't let you go into race from sure, start. Sure, sure, no, sure, it's sure. Wrong, man. I'll follow you, so wait for me. Okay, darling. It's so cold! <laughs> it's so cold! But what a lovely looking car! Tony, welcome back to the channel. Thank you. Hello. Yeah. Um, we're in the completely opposite places. Usually you're in the passenger seat and I'm in the driver's seat. But today we're changing that because you've just picked up this bad boy, right? Yeah, man. This is going to be one of the first Julia Qualholl. How'd you say it? Qualholl. Quadrifolio. Qualholl. Yeah, QV. QV. Um, <laughs> what, have I, wait, have I locked my car? Let's make sure of that, because that's definitely someone's going to want to nick it. Yeah. Um, it's going to be on the market, right? Yeah. Yeah. Amazing, it's so cool. I literally love these things. As I think most people think, oh, I've got very little battery. Oh, it's quite unprepared today. <laughs> um, uh, yes, one of my favorite cars of all time, as the channel kind of know. Um, You've driven how many miles in it? Uh, two. <laughs> I've just, we just literally picked it up. <laughs> literally picked it up. It is beautiful in here with the green and white stitching and all the leather bits, carbon fiber everywhere. And the best thing about them all is the paddles. Yeah, big Do you know paddles. I love those yeah, paddles? I love, I, 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 lo I love the whole car. Yeah, start stop button on the steering wheel yeah. is really cool. Like Ferrari. Oh. We both know that we're big fans of that right. brand. Uh, so anyway, we're going to go for a little poodle, guys. Um, this, as I say, as you know from the intro, uh, is very much a unprepared, stressful day for me, which you'd have it no other way with us filming, would you? No, me being, no. me being stressed and no, together, no, no. yeah. <laughs> Um, but I appreciate you anyway, uh, hanging around and letting me check out this car because I will say, so cool. I hope you keep this one for a while. I hope it doesn't sell. Yeah, so do I, actually. Just so we can have some fun with it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You're intrigued by them, aren't you? Yeah. Uh, um, you was uh, a part of the reason why I bought one. As Ooh. in, because you said to me, 
this is going to be a sick car, but which made me think, well, actually, do you know what? He's probably right. Yeah, that did actually sound like me. It's going to be yeah. a sick car. Yeah, yeah. 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 So captured um, me, captured me well then. Looks unbelievable. Yeah. Uh, in the price range of an M3 and a C63 as well. I think it's got more flair. It's got a lot more flair. Just following you just two seconds ago from behind, it's just sat down so hunkered on the road. I love it. All the carbon so on the nice outside. In here. Yeah. I got very limited time in the quad when I went for the test drive. Oh, you drove it, right? Oh, I drove yeah, it yeah. For, for, on track, and I say it was all of about three minutes, so I'd forgotten just how much nicer it is than the standard car in here. It really, this feels premium, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's lovely. But do you know what? It's really simple. Like everything's all, they've not confused everything by putting all of this yeah. in there. And yeah, it's yeah, not yeah, all yeah. really simple. Uh, I can't really tell you how it drives because I've done like, <laughs> two, miles. two miles. Yeah, and I can't tell you how it drives on the road. Uh, yeah. It's only on track. So this is a fantastic review from Sam and Tony. <laughs> Sam and Tony's fantastic new car yeah. reviews. But uh, but you're gonna you're at least gonna have it for this week before it, it gets snapped off your hands, I'm sure, because these cars are, are gonna be in mega demand, wouldn't you? Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna I'm gonna use it for a while. Okay. To get to know about it, so, yeah, so yeah, I know yeah. what's going on. Uh, we should probably have filmed this video in a week's time, <laughs> shouldn't we? <laughs> so what are we doing? <laughs> uh, yeah, I know nothing about it. Yeah, so this yeah, is yeah. all a learning experience for me. So so, well, um, the, the biggest thing just from, from my side, which I know I, I told you before because we've been banging on a WhatsApp about it, but is the way that this car handles and the balance of it. It really... Yeah, um, it really feels like it's got that sort of Ferrari Maserati characteristics in it. I don't know what it is about the steering or the weight distribution. And it's got a lot of tricks on it, this car. Yeah, well, first driving impressions, like literally now. Just cruising. It's comfortable. Yeah. It's a lot more comfortable. That's a central. That's a central. Yeah. yeah, it's, you know, and that, ah, ah. Ah, that's your bumpy road mode. Ah, ah. Bumpy so road softer. mode, yeah. And then DNA, dynamic. I always feel like normal, normal. natural, and then uh, all weather, and then obviously it yeah, races the silly, silly mode. Um, I did notice, yeah. I on. have noticed that on the other cars you can make the sports exhaust, there's a button for a sports exhaust. Sure. The only way you can oh, make a sports exhaust. Oh, my battery might have been, like, we might need to pull over. Oh. <laughs> not, to, no, not, not that emergency, not to just really cut you off and ruin yeah, your Yeah, thanks, I forgot what I was going to say now. Sorry guys. Uh, the, the sports exhaust has a button. Make it, quick point. Yeah. That's oh, but it. on this on this car, it doesn't. You have to put it in race, which yeah. means you turn the track. Well, no, no, or, or dynamic. You don't have no. to be in race. No, look. So look. Oh yeah, there's valves. So now the valves are on, but now you've got no traction control. So in this weather, it's like. No, that's a different way. We'll figure that out. Can you pull over so I can get a new battery? Yeah. Sorry. <laughs> See. because I'm pretty sure uh, that you can sports exhaust is somewhere uh, this is a highly entertaining feature for those watching uh, I mean this is a big reason why I buy it yeah. because you, this is how you learn of course you yeah you never learn on a test drive you only learn by owning them well okay well for now yeah only having the valves open in race is a bit poo poo yeah so most cars would have a button have a yeah car. just put, put the exhaust nothing. on there's no reason I, I, I looked well, and you just shift down through the gears just to open the valves earlier, I guess. So, first impressions, fantastic. I'm impressed. As always, a big thanks to Tony for being my YouTube hamster. <laughs> um, I appreciate you taking the time to, to sure. show me around the car. It's been really cool to check it out. I, I say a very rushed video. We are definitely going to do more things with Tony, but also this car if he doesn't sell it. 
troll him. Uh, I hope you guys have enjoyed it anyway. Give it a thumbs up if you have, and make sure to subscribe for plenty more videos to come.